this rom uh, might beat dot os and corvus os and descendant os and almost all the unique custom roms out there this room is kind of underrated if you talk about the unique base custom rooms i'm not talking about that this room is underrated a lot of underrated custom rooms i've already talked about this one is not underrated but if you compare it with other ones which have unique ui this room is in that category and that is why it's underrated what is the different in this one what is the difference in this one and why it is kind of underrated first of all in this new update what we have is the new launcher which was not available previously as far as i know we were having the launcher but in this one we have the normal quick step launcher maybe a modified one which includes some extra options for you some customizations for you if you move on to the settings options you have the app drawer customizations and we also have at last but not the least hidden and protected apps so might be a very good choice if you want to install this room you need these things and this is called a project arcana and a lot of users will definitely love this thing this is one of the major highlights about the new latest update of this room you can see this quick settings panel it's almost same like dot os it's almost same like android 11 but it has all the android 12.1 kind of things available android 12.1 animations are already included as you can just see but the thing is it's android 12.1 it's just the quick setting panel is looking like android 11 and let me know in the comment box if you like this or if you just want to ignore this same kind of with that the default things for example the default dialer is from octavi os which i'm not able to show you because i don't have any kind of sim card or recent calls available but you can see we have the force browser which is pre-installed it it is actually a vanilla build which i'm using right now as actually unofficial vanilla build available officially for a lot of devices it's not a device specific review by the way it's just about the latest update and latest changes which we have i also found a very new and interesting change in this one which i will talk about this is a quick settings panel so this is a settings ui and if you want the grimoire option which includes these customizations you have the device theming options extras notifications lock screen quick settings and some status bar customizations which you have by default included in this one if i move on to the device settings now you have a device theming now you have the option to customize the settings ui if i go back and check out and this is how as you can see this is you can customize the settings ui if you move on to the grimoire option settings layout you can customize it according to oxygen os 11 12 and i think it also looks good by the way it's all about users preferences if you want to use it you can if you don't want to use it if you just want to ignore it you can very easily we can even customize the monet engine like monet colors the fonts and icon pack and etc etc all the customizations are available as expectedly so nothing to worry about that and same kind of thing if you move on to some other customizations extras includes unlimited google photo storage unlimited unlock higher fps in games and if you talk about the games the new gaming space is already present of course same like with that some basic customizations include some lock screen customizations for you we have some notification related options where you can customize the notification account we can enable the notification account option if you want to and some quick settings customizations have the brightness slider related customization which is not a major thing and same like with that some status bar options clock battery etc etc same kind of things available here and there system does not include any kind of major changes other than else things are basically same kind of underrated if you talk about the ui and in every update we have something new in project arcana so yes this is why i just want to let you know about the latest project arcana update if this build is available for your device the link for the official website is already available go and install this thing on advice if you want to if your device does not have the official build make sure to check out the unofficial on xda or telegram these were things i just wanted to let you know i hope you like this Thanks for watching and as always, I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye. Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through the air.